for Ricardo. Uh, Ricardo, obviously, this is a huge win for you tonight. You know, coming in, uh, we knew all the stories about Hoke. You turned down the title fight and he got to fight with you. Uh, can you just kind of give us your overall impressions of the fight? And did he do anything that surprised you? And I mean, I guess the biggest question is how excited were you with the win, especially with him being, in most people's estimation, the number two featherweight? I was very excited. Um, a little disappointed I couldn't finish the fight. I was really trying hard too, but I mean, the guy's tough, you know, I, I get my hats off to him. Um, and going into the fight, I didn't really know what to expect because he's very unorthodox and it's hard to uh, train for a guy like that. Uh, you know, other than, you know, I wish I would have finished the fight. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy about my overall performance. Um, it, it's obviously, it's the biggest point of your career. Just talk to you. Is it so uh, yeah, I think so, a little bit. You know, I, I'm sure it'll settle in a little more. Um, it was it was a huge win. I'm, I'm really happy with the outcome. Um, not much to say, man. I'm, I'm, I'm just happy. I'm happy to be here. I, I love being in the UFC. It's nothing else I want to do. Um, can you take us through those guillotine attempts, please, and, and kind of how those factored in the fight? Was that encouraging or discouraging? And uh, yeah, I'd just love to hear your take on that. It, it wasn't encouraging or discouraging. I just uh, I was a little mad at myself for, for even being taken down by him. But um, I was trying to attack off my back as much as I could so you know, and, and stay active. And my hat's off to him because I don't know how he was breathing. I mean, he, he held his breath for a long time. And, um, at first, I was really trying to over squeeze a little too much on those first couple of guillotines and then I was listening to my corner a little more they told me not not to go crazy and kind of keep the position and you know little by little so uh, that that last arm and guillotine I had was tight and he wasn't breathing but you know he's a warrior and he just didn't want to give up so you know my hat's off to him.